set up. Okay, right then. So it looks like we're live. Uh, so let's 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 do this thing. Here we go. Right, welcome to the LARP Book Show. I apologise in advance for any drilling that you might hear in the background. Um, next, next door neighbour is a builder and likes to build things. It's as simple as that. It's what he does all the time. Uh, I don't think he's actually finished an entire project in the entire house. But however, there we go. This is what I live with. Doesn't tend to do stuff in the evening, but what? Well, oh yeah, there we go. Right, so uh, I'm Stuart Edwards and with me as always is Robert Davis. Hi, Rob. How are you? And well, thank you, Stu. How are you? Oh, not too bad, thank you. Right, uh, we thought we'd have a little chat today uh, about the future of kind of um, LARP book and, and its streaming. Yeah. Um, now, I'm getting a little bit of echo back. What's going on there? Ooh. This could be fun. All right. Uh -oh. <laughs> I wonder if I'm getting that back from, from you, Rob. I don't know. Um... Mm. interesting right we'll 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 carry on we'll carry on and we'll see what it sounds like later uh it also helps tell you what we're going to do this again in a second because i haven't hit record <laughs> <laughs> live you've got to love live <laughs> hi anybody's actually watching this sorry and all that uh <sighs> Try again, shall we? Yeah. We just give it a giggle, right? Yeah. Let's hit record. Let's hit record on the audio. There we go. Okay. Uh, 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 I'm I'm glad no one's actually. I don't think anyone's actually watching us at the moment. I'm kind of glad. Uh, uh, right, so, uh, no, no, no. Uh, we, we've actually had a light. Have we? Uh, right. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's you know what. Let's just do this again. One, three, two, one. Welcome to the LARP Book Show. Um, my name's Stuart Edwards. I think I know why. Yes, I can see why. How have you pressed the button this time? Let me kill that. Yeah, it was the iPad. It was the iPad recording my voice as well. Right, so welcome to the LARP Book Show. Uh, my name's Stuart Edwards, and with me, uh, as always, of course, is Robert Davis. How are you, Rob? <laughs> I am well, thank you, Stu. Surviving. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Now I've sussed out what that was. Damn iPad. Right then. <laughs> right, what we're going to discuss today is a, this is a special one. It's not an actual show. We're just going to kind of discuss the, the future of LARP book, all right, and uh, what it means for the, the, the streaming, etc. You know, what, what programs we use, where we stream to. We thought we'd give another little go of streaming to Facebook, which has always been, you know, the bane of my existence, it would seem. Um. And also a little discussion about the, the different things that we use. And to put it over to you, the viewers, yeah, um, what you think would be good for us, whether or not just to uh, continue using Facebook, continue using Twitch, uh, or how, how you even consume our, you know, our, in what, what we do. You know, it, do you not tune in live? Do you predominantly go to YouTube to watch the videos afterwards? Do you get it through the, the, the podcast, you know, just audio only? Uh, those sorts of, that sort of information really, really kind of helps us out um, in the long run. So, right, let's let's kind of start this then. So um, let me discuss a, a, a little bit about what uh, we're trying out here today. Um, it's a system called uh, Lightstream. Uh, it's very good. It's, it's very useful. Uh, it does have limitations just like everything else it has limitations um it does certain things really 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 well like setting it up i mean it, it's it's all powered from a web browser that i love all right doesn't need any special programs doesn't need any sort of real knowledge other than the fact if you've ever used uh, photoshop in your life you know about you know uh, layers and layering things and that's about it yeah, it doesn't need anything any more than that. Uh, you can do some special uh, fancy things there, and they do have tutorials. 
Like if you notice right now, uh, if you're watching the live stream or you watch the video later on, you'll see that I've got a, a follow us and it keeps changing from like like iTunes to the website to Twitter, etc. You know, it, that'll keep sort of rolling um, as we go along. Those sorts of things can kind of help out. Yeah. And there's lots of other information you can, you can display as well. But here's what I want to know. First off, uh, how do you actually watch the show? Do you watch the show or do you listen to the show? Which platform would be better for you? Would it be Facebook? Would it be Twitch? Uh, we don't bother to try and stream to YouTube because that's also a small nightmare in itself. Um, <laughs> it's bloody hard work. Uh, so th that's the sort of thing that we want to know first off, right? Mm -hmm. um, Rob and I both have very different different opinions on a certain on certain things, which is why we want to discuss a little bit today. Uh, and you know, uh, so here's here, here's my angle. I I like streaming to Twitch because you don't have to do any sort of pre setup. Once you've logged into your account, got your stream key and all the rest of it, that's it. You never have to think about that ever again. Ever. You just bring up your program, you hit go, and you're streaming live. Right? It's as simple as that. Um, but it doesn't have the, the reach um, or perhaps the interaction that Facebook has. Now, that's why Rob loves Facebook. Am I right? Mm -hmm. You're right. I love the fact that we can reach out and immediately see, interact with people. Yeah. Um, oh, yes. And by the way, uh, in case you are uh, streaming in, if you hear any drilling in the background, again, I do apologize. Uh, it is my next door neighbor. He is a builder and he just likes, I, I'm sure he's just got a, a big block or something in his house. He just drills because he can't have that much of the house left to drill. That's all I'm saying. He has, <laughs> he, I, he has a Swiss cheese house. I, I yeah, I, I begin to think you know, really beginning to consider that's that's what's going on there. So, <laughs> so let, let let's discuss. Let um. So, Rob, what's what's your thoughts on this? Well, well look, we've um, we in the past we streamed to YouTube and to yeah. Twitch and yeah. Facebook, yeah. and every time we've done this, it's gone pretty much the same way. Uh, is Twitch, we get a small number of people interacting with the show. Yeah. YouTube, pretty much ne <laughs> n n no one. Um, very often when we start, especially when we have guests on, we get a lot of interaction through, through, through Facebook. So that's okay. live interaction as the show is running. And then yeah. on top of that, we get comments afterwards as well. So with, okay. so with Facebook, I feel it puts us more in touch, it puts us more in touch with the people who are watching the show more in touch with the laughers out there and more and this mainly we, we can actually, actually interact and touch, um, work with more people okay. this to me kind of the whole, the whole objective of anything but it doesn't seem to work on other platforms uh i do actually agree that the video quality on twitch has been very good um the same for youtube so i've got there's no quality issue for me there in fact if anything facebook's had the first the worst video quality of the of the lot yeah, now that that that, 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 that could also be, yeah, that that could also be down to me as well, mind I forget, right? You know, um, <laughs> you know in, in the sheer fact that you have to try and set up, because I was using OBS for that, yeah, um, and trying to set. I mean, OBS can either work beautifully or just not at all. Right? It's as yeah. simple as that, um, and that can be a real, real pain in the backside. Uh, That's right. the, so are we hoping that a live stream is actually the first a better platform? Yeah, I mean, I would say I would say it is. Um, you know, under the just the sheer fact of simplicity. Yeah. Uh, simplicity of the system. Um, yeah. I don't really have to think too hard about it, if you know what yeah. I mean. I understand uh, that. So so yeah. Uh, yeah, I can just log in, set up the things I need to do, uh, pick which, you know, platform I'm going to stream on. I mean, that's the only other thing as well. It is a uh, 
a one shot stream so you can only you know stream to one particular stream i don't know whether or not that functionality uh will change in years to come uh yeah. when they update things um but it is also super easy to actually invite people in into the stream as well and that's really important because we, we like to have guests on the show um, and one of the things I noticed coming on to the live stream was I get I get a little prep area where I can go, okay, check my microphone's working, check my headset's working, check the video looks okay, then I go in. Whereas with what we're using at the moment, it's like, I'm in. Uh-oh, it doesn't work. Excuse me while I back back out, reset yeah. everything and go back in again, which isn't great. It, no, it, that's right. It could be better. <laughs> yeah, I agree with that. I mean, yeah. It like, like I say again that that other system that that, that we use as well um, is a system called uh, a peer dot in. Yeah. Um, you know, again, it works or doesn't. I mean, we, we we even pay the premium for that. You know, for yeah. the, the premium service for that to get the better video, you know, the better video and audio quality. Yeah. Uh, but again, it is one of those systems where works or doesn't. Nothing in between. That's right. Yeah. Um... It is good in that it, anybody we can we can get as many people as we want in there in one go. Yeah, that's really nice. Yeah, yeah. The, uh, say with Lightstream, as I said, there, there there is there is a limitation. The limitation is it can be me plus four guests. Now, as you know, normally we have four um, uh, presenters. Four presenters. Four yeah. presenters. Anyway, right? So, as you can imagine. You know, that's my guests. If you if you want to think of another word, you know, you know, and another way of saying it, that's my guest slots taken up. Uh, so oh, if yeah. you want to bring on guests, I mean, then we can do it. I've discovered, but you won't be able to see me now. Some of you may think that's a plus point. Um, you know, in in the green room. <laughs> 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 you know, but it's a limitation. Yeah. You know, it it is a limitation. Uh, I have been in touch with the developers to say, eh, can you just eat out a few more, you know, just make it up to eight or something like that. Yeah. yeah. And, and they said, yeah, we'll consider it. So watch this space, you know, in that, in, in that way. But this is a super easy system to use. Yeah. I, I, you know, I will say that. Although I don't think I can see the Facebook chat in this one. I think I can see the Twitch chat in this but not the okay. facebook right well i can see at the moment as a guest if you like i can see a nice green picture of you there's a screen chat of course i've also got another screen i've got facebook so i can see what's going on there yeah yeah you know that, that that's the other thing i mean again using this system if we were linked into twitch yeah. i could actually see the twitch chat in the side panel yeah, yeah and that would be useful. And I, but I think that's one of the problems we've got is that we know that from a technical perspective and like an openness perspective, Twitch is probably the better platform. Yeah. The trouble is, is that I don't think Twitch gels that much with the larger sort of global laughing community. No, it probably doesn't. Mm. It probably doesn't. I mean, I mean, you know, you... You talk to anybody and and you know and 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 tell them you know, oh yeah. By the way, you know, have you, do you watch people who game on Twitch? Uh, sorry, yeah, on 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 Twitch, and they go, yeah. What? What's Twitch? What's that? Yeah, you know, I've, had so, quite a, I've had quite a few what's that and what's Twitch. It's um, and that to me is part of the problem. Where everybody goes, oh Facebook, yeah, it, it just comes on. Yeah. No, that's right. Yeah. Right. You know, and and there is the ability to schedule broadcasts as well. Um, that that's a fantastic uh, facility for Facebook, but like I say the if they only would go the route of uh, giving you a dedicated like stream key or something like that, so you didn't have to faff about with it every time. Yeah, although I must admit this system is actually pretty good. You don't have to faff about with it. You can just say. You can just say go live, and it'll. I can even choose which page to put it on, and uh, what have you. Yeah, so it is actually a lot better that way, yeah. um, in that respect. But it, I can't. You know, the other one I have thing, thing I have discovered is I can't link into a pre-scheduled Facebook thing. 
Yeah, well, it's not so bad. We, we can still announce and sort of tell people what we're doing on Facebook. But it'd be nice yeah. to pre-schedule, it'd be nice to pre-schedule as well, just to help people understand what's going when we're com- going live. Yeah, no, I I I completely agree. Um, so I suppose like everything else, I mean, the one thing that I kind of want to know from our listeners is how do you consume our content? Uh, you know, is it is it via this sort of uh, platform? Is it uh, just via the podcast? Um, is it via YouTube? You know, what do you use to watch us? Uh, that that would be sort of a useful information for us to know, to be honest with you. Um, the other thing as well that I, I do like about this system is um, you can actually change things live and then, and then, and then kind of push it out. Yeah. yeah? Um, like I've, I've just, uh, uh, you know, um, made, made our, our video boxes a bit bigger and you should see that coming to translate through uh, on on the live stream uh, Wait, <laughs> you know uh so you know you, you you can kind of pre-push stuff in mm. which is clever yeah oh, it is uh, it's really good you know in in that respect uh so yeah so so let us know leave it in the you know in the comments below or, or you know email the show or uh you know lotbookshow at gmail.com uh, and let us know how you actually consume the content. Yeah, I mean, obviously the website's always there, but we do, we really want to talk about the shows now and how do you consume this, the various shows and bits of video, especially the shows. Yeah, you know, so um, that would kind of really help. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so, is there anything else you want to talk about, Rob? Uh, at the moment, I think there'll be a few a few announcements coming up through this month. So we'll be we're getting a few more bits and pieces in. Which is okay. going to help us get out some more laps. If that all goes well, I'll announce it as it happens. Um, Excellent. And if you are watching this video, go on to the go on to the Facebook page and have, just have a look at the link for Crimson Moon because they could do with your help, and they are really important to the UK lap. If you're in the UK, help them. Yeah. So yeah, um, as Rob said, go go across to to the page. Uh, on Facebook, have a little look at the uh, uh, other thing there for the Crimson Moon. Uh, they are the people that supply you lots of alcohol um, at at different events that you've probably been to. You've you've probably consumed stuff uh, from them. Um, mm-hmm. They they have a little bit of a, a kind of a Kickstarter. Is that is that, is that right, Rob? Yeah, yeah. They're using a crowd. They're using they're using crowdfunder, I believe. I'm just going to double check that for you now. Okay. Uh, what it is is that they need to fund a brand new, well, a new improved lead mobile because the old one is breaking down. Yes, yes, and they've they've, they've, they've no had it a little while now, you know. So and no, uh, mead mo- no mead mobile means no mead at events or beer. Yeah, well, uh, obviously, um, that would be a terrible shame. Um, <laughs> So why not go across there and and show them some love, uh, as I'm I'm sure they will find some way to show you that love back, because oh, I know yeah. what they're like. <laughs> you know they uh, they all definitely show show the love back. Oh, they've actually so, got they've um, actually got a few quite nice little rewards there as well. Oh, there you go. I I knew they'd have rewards up. I mean that was you know blatantly obvious for the type of people that they are. Uh, oh yeah, Inclu- including. Including photos with the wenches or emperor fool, as you do, you know, oh, t-shirts, crimson moon mugs. <laughs> right, so there you so go. That's anyway, that's much, enough for that. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much all from us uh, today. Um, I just a sort of quick thing to take it out, you know, take us out then, because I do need to say thank you to a few people as well. Uh, every time I do one of these, anyway. So. Um, um, thank you very much then obviously Rob for coming along doing this sort of quickly on this very beautiful uh, Saturday afternoon um, uh, music provided by Ben Sound at bensound.com and I'm going to do this all at the top of my head because I haven't got any notes in front of me hey, thanks a lot uh, thanks a lot to our lovely patrons you know who help keep this show going it does help you know and if you think 
you can possibly spare just a dollar a month to help out the show, then pop across to uh, patreon.com forward slash LARPbook. Uh, you can get in touch with the show, LARPbookshow at gmail.com. Just send us some news reviews, any questions, you know, we're, we'll we'll do that. Even, you know, hit us up on Facebook. Uh, I helped out a lovely lady the other day uh, on LARP Haven, I think it was, who whose daughter is getting into LARPs. Uh, she wants to encourage and uh, asked me, you know, well, ask the group, is there any sort of LARPs around and how to go about doing things? You know, we uh, did a private message thing and I, I helped her out as much as I possibly could. Uh, showed her where the LARPs were, you know, in her immediate area and pointed her to certain ones um, that I think might be good for them. So, mm. you know, we'll do that sort of thing. We're, we're happy with that, you know, uh, not, not a problem that way. Um, so, as I said, you know, thanks a lot for tuning in uh, and we hope to see you all soon. Bye bye. Bye bye and thank you. And there we go. And I shall end stream. Bye all. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.